In this period, a significant figure emerged, Julius Caesar. Although widely known for his military and political prowess, Caesar also possessed exceptional managerial skills. As a general of a private army, he showcased his capabilities and appealed to the wealthy, convincing them that foreign conquests could yield enormous profits. By securing sponsors, Caesar was able to amass significant investments, which he used to strengthen his army and achieve successive conquests. Wealthy individuals vied to sponsor Caesar, and, as Roman money flowed in, Caesar's army became even more powerful. The soldiers' standard of living improved significantly. Rising as a leader of the masses, Caesar eventually led a coup, overthrowing the aristocratic senate that had once sponsored him and seizing dictatorial power. Caesar's support stemmed from the burgeoning impoverished class, making him a leader born from their plight. In this sense, Caesar's emergence was not merely a dazzling embellishment of Roman history, but a result of the accumulated discontent among the impoverished. It was this very discontent that fueled Rome's transformation into a world empire. The privileges enjoyed by a successful few are confined within their circle, but when the masses are marginalized, their anger and resentment become a formidable force that, in any era, can shake and reshape society in the times.